He can fuck right off. Boy. Father, please, just listen. Invari's crew did something bad here. He's glad you destroyed his life, and he's sorry you kept trying to trick him. His hammer is just through this gate. Yeah. <laughs> I need to remember to use the talisman now, because previously that's something that I haven't had to think about. I've I've got better at remembering all the all the different things I have an offer to use. Oh, that's another one. To add. I should think about using the uh, blades of chaos sometimes. I do forget they're there. Boy, over oh, I here. swear to Christ, is this another Sir. treasure map? Just be law. Please just... Oh, thank you. The Soul Eaters. Removing an ancient soul and domesticating it as a beast of burden was surprisingly easy. They followed my every command and appeared to possess no free will, sense of self-preservation, or even hunger. Well, not until it turned poor Lit into ashes. Not even his soul remained. A lack of their own must be what drives them to immolate the souls of others. My Soul Eaters are an abomination. Several were sent to Musfelheim at the request of Surta. What he will use them for, I shudder to consider. At an, another term, Motsignia at Kurnansgard, that fool can burn for all I care. My immediate concern is the dwarves of the Volunder Mines. I pray I'm not too late to undo my mistake, Anfari. Interesting. And what have we got today? Our survey says... Oh, it's a massive fucking... This is a fine hammer. Anvari says thank you. Hammer of the Dwarven Blacksmith Anvari of value to Brock. Well, alrighty then. Can we get through here? I feel like we should be able to because that's the chain down, right? Oh, okay. Did not see this. Wee. We will talk to the blue one. Ready yourself, boy. Huh? Oh. Watch out, boy! Work team. Okay. What is this? World Serpent Scale. Oh, I bet that fell off the dude that we um knocked off. Wait, that sounds bad. You know what I mean. A brock. Got a little summon summon. Oh, that's I thought that was a box. Here, the alchemist's hammer. His spirit is a nuisance. Yeah, Anvari always was an asshole. Hell of an alchemist, though. Hand him over here and I'll melt him down. What? You're going to melt down your friend? A trapped soul's what I need to give your reward some extra oomph. You don't want it? Father. We can't do that. Here, you sure we can. Him. He's really useful, I promise. Fine. So long as he proves his worth. What? And Vari's soul? Kid's a bit of a softy, huh? Hmm. Well, he'll grow up. Very high perk activation chance to My grant a health pass on any project. successful runic Come attack kill. Come see us kill. at the temple if it so please you. That could be good. Hmm. That does have potential. Hmm.
So this is eight and three with a terrible perk. This is eight, four, six with a good perk. Oh wait, it's runic instead of strength. I mean, yeah. <laughs> That's too good to pass up for now, I think. Nice. And Vari. And Vari wasn't very helpful at first, but something about seeing that dead soul eater in Lansutha Mines made him realise he was being kind of a jerk. I think he feels guilty because he and some other dwarves were experimenting with ancients there, and they accidentally created soul eaters. Glad we didn't have to fight anymore. Anyway, his soul is still trapped in a ring. Brock wanted to melt him down. He can be so mean sometimes. But I convinced Father to keep him, and now he's part of our group. Father even uses Anzvari's soul as an enchantment sometimes. Must be hard being trapped in a piece of jewellery, but Anzvari doesn't complain too much. I've gotten pretty good at, ign at ignoring him. Wow. Feels bad. Cool. Oh, you lucky seagull. Right. So, <laughs> next. That's not what I wanted. Uh, oh yeah, we've got to let the spirit in Fafnir's storeroom know his son's died. Okay, we'll do that next. Is there a quick way to get to there? Uh, it's up there. So I guess that's the best one. Here we go. My god, do I not like this fast travel system. Do 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 do. No, I don't. Did the do 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 do. Kind of sounded important. I'm sure it's nothing. He just said the voice seemed familiar to him. Me? That's impossible. Don't I quite agree? Unless perhaps he refers to something yet to be. It so, is said that when Jormungandr and Thor battle at Ragnarok, their clash so violently shakes the Tree of Life that it splinters, casting the serpent backward through time, even before his own birth. What? That is madness. Well, I did say not to concern yourself. Now that is something that will be in God of War 2, because I looked it up. Jormund of the World Serpent has already fought Thor in Ragnarok and was knocked back in time to now. That or Mimir is insane. So, yeah, uh... Oh my god, I just noticed XP, I have 192,000, Hacksilver, I have 350k, when did this happen, man? Um, yeah, I, I once I beat the game, I looked up, and uh, Jormunda, Jormungandr, that's the one, Jormungandr, uh, is Loki's child in the Legends, so our boy, boy, grows up, somehow... Has a snake kid, not entirely sure on how that works. Which grows up to be the World Serpent and fights Thor and gets knocked back in time to now. And that's why he recognises Loki, because Loki's his dad. In some weird way. But that'll be next time. I look forward to time travelling, God of War. Brock and I are working on something special for you at the temple. Okay, we'll go there next. Uh, what's this? Oh yeah, we need to... Ah, oh, damn. Pure essence of realms. I have no idea what that is or how to get it. Hmm. Unless it's something I can buy? Resources? Pure essence of realms by any chance? Sure isn't. Okay. Okay, um... Come back when you need something, I guess. Bye! I hear you. There you are. Gotcha. Please don't have respawned enemies. Please, please, please. Fuck.
Got him. Not too hard. <laughs> that was alright. Thank you. So, which way was it again? It was just up here, right? Atreus, to me. I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, yeah, I'd forgotten about this. This was a, um... Oh, what should we call it? A map. A tunnel frost. Unmailable. Yep. Pommels with frost damage effects. Nice. Oh, and... Eye of Runic Mastery. Taking damage during a runic attack reduces damage taken by 15%. That's not very good. That is not very good. Oh, dead dad. <laughs> Got some news for you. This is a very pretty room, I have to say. What are you fool? We found your son. He, he was super dead. Too. And we found part of his journal. It sounded like he regretted killing you. <laughs> Fat lot of good that does me. How'd he go out? Like a bitch. We found four corpses near his. They were decapitated. Ha! <laughs> Vandrid always did keep his sword nice and sharp. A lesson he picked up from me. He's a backstabbing bastard, but knowing he's in Valhalla sets me at ease. Thanks. Oh, Tears he Shard. Hello, he bonus to all stats. That thief did not deserve the peace you gave him. Maybe so. Still, it feels good to help people, even the dead ones. <laughs> so much like your mother. Uh, bonus to all stats. So, what have we got in here? Increase the frost damage, increase the rate of... See, those work so well together. Uh, and this one... Well, what's the difference between this and Tear Shard? That one's seven to everything. This one's six to everything except luck, which is a bunch up, so... What was this one again? Man. I don't want to get rid of any of these. I feel like of all of them, this one is the one I can get rid of the most. Because I don't use the blades as much as the axe anyway. Nice. Okay, now... Wait, hang on. Where's the... Oh, it is there. It just looked like a wall. I was like, where's the door? Duh. Now, we will head back to the temple and see what uh, Brock and Sindri are doing, because they've mentioned that they should uh, that I should see them a couple of times now. And so we shall. That looks like somewhere you can go up. Hmm. Maybe I came out there once, I don't remember. And then I don't know, I think we'll then be travelling to the other two realms, because we've pretty much done everything here, apart from the Valkyries, which we're leaving to last, so... Yeah. Niflheim or Musfelheim? Which should we try first? I don't know. Brock and I have been working on a new project at the temple. Okay, we will. Come um, visit soon. I should actually have a look if there's anything. Man, I want that so bad. These level seven shit. Man. I can't even remember what I'm wearing, to be honest. Uh, 
Ah, whatever. Well, it's fine. Scrounge around a bit more, and we'll build something then. To the temple. Uh, what's it called? Rock shop. Why is Odin so desperate to find a way into Jotunheim anyway? He's convinced the giants hold the key to changing his fate when Ragnarok comes. They are the Aesir's oldest enemies, after all. And it's their army that's supposed to do him in in the end. But more than that, he covets their gifts of prophecy. He wants to know what they know and see what they see. So much suffering could have been avoided if his insatiable curiosity was not so much stronger than his wisdom. What do you mean? Ah. Remind me to tell you why they call him the Lord of the Hang. Odin's interest in Jotunheim, he fears the giants at Ragnarok and wants their prophecies of the future. Giants are the best at prophecy? Question mark? Ask me mere later why they call Odin Lord of the Hanged. Will do. Not sure why you can just tell us then, but hey. <laughs> Hello, lads. My brother and me got a new project. Now that we're on speaking terms. Oh, yeah? What do you want? With the whetstone and hammer you've retrieved for us? Brock and I can construct the Devagrathiker, Dwarven ah, yes, Armor that. of Legend. We just need three more mythical three. ingredients oh, before we God. set to hammer. Which are? Dunno. Armor's pure legend, and the details is fuzzier than a wolver's butthole. <laughs> Do you expect us to find parts from a legend? Oh, Motsognir the Dwarf King found two of them. Everyone knows that. But when he went looking for the third, poof, he vanished. Maybe he'll find some clues at his stronghold in Konungsgard. And looky here, a Konungsgard entry stone. It's got your name on it. How fucking strange. Okay. Didn't we already... The strong... Where is that on the map? Over here? Okay. Never mind. That's not what I thought it was then. Uh... What is that? Question is, how did you get there? Is it a lead on from here? King's Hollow? Possibly. It goes northwest to here, behind the Svartalfheim realm tower. Large stone structure, creepy atmosphere. You'll know it when you see it. The Holder Brothers. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Okay. What's it called again? King's Hollow. Let's try that. That might be the one that we couldn't get into, actually. Want to tell me about the hanged thing? Hey, there we go. That refers to a modest example of Odin's thirst for knowledge. The time he spent nine days a dead man. Aye. Hung himself by the neck from Yggdrasil's branches, put his spear through his own side, and bled down into the Well of Destiny. He roamed the realms of the Nuts. dead and plundered <laughs> the royal tree of its secrets, until I think, quite rightly, it got fed up with him and sent him back to the land of the living. Did I not mention he was barking mad? <laughs> Odin spent nine days dead hanging from Yggdrasil, the world tree, for the wisdom of life and death and destiny. He goes really far to get what he wants. Yeah, no shit. Okay, time to find out if this was a wasted fast travel or not. I sure hope so. Ooh, that's promising. I think that's the door. Oh, happy days. Happy fucking days. Just please no dark elves. Anything but that. 